What's up guys, Brad and Connor here, and today I thought we'd bring uh, a little let's play for the Dragon Age 2 demo, and so far it looks a pretty good game, and we thought we would just like show you what it's about and good and bad points about it really. Mm, very graphical. Very. Um, it went me who played this, it was Connor, so I don't really know what's happening, but the game... So Looks so right. we're just picking his character, so you have like a male and female from each of the three characters. Which oh, what can you be? Uh, you can be a male warrior, female warrior, male mage, female mage, and I didn't quite catch the end one. I'm guessing it'll probably be a range, ranging warrior, whatever, I don't know. Um, Bioware Productions, awesome. I don't, I don't know if you played yeah. uh, number one, but I played number one. Uh, really enjoyed it. Re uh, very action-packed game, so I'm expecting a lot from number two. Yeah, when's it come out? Uh, I, don't know. I actually do not know. I hope it's pretty yeah. soon, actually. Cause I don't know either. I never really. I never had number one. I wouldn't know a thing about Dragon Age. Could be some sort of Lego game for Alana. I don't know. <laughs> Very different from my own game, Brad. Now, alright. So, so at the beginning of the uh, demo, there is a lot of cinematic scenes uh, which you can't skip, so you're just going to sit here patiently. Patiently. Dragon Age 2. Alright. First part. What's that? Oh, first part, you're just like moving along with a girl and uh, you get ambushed by some dark spawn. Oh, that's his sister, am I right? I think that's his sister. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. she's a mage. Oh, wow, the and blood. As said, very graphical. Hmm. Very suits its age rating. Is it an 18? Uh, yeah, I think so. I think one was. Yeah, I was going to say, because when I, I saw Dragon Age 1 in the shop, so like, it didn't look a very, really gory game, and I wonder why it were an 18, but now looking at this, I know why. So at first you'll have some doubts on come to our gym, you'll just need to, like, fight them off. You do get some in-game instructions, so it's pretty simple, you won't get stuck. Is there any, like, combo moves you can do on? Yeah, they're the, um... The combo moves are the ones in the bottom right corner, which uh, can be controlled by X, Y, and B. And if you press, I think it's R, T, you flip to another three behind. But in the demo, you've only got the first three. Like X is like a space attack, Y is like a single slice, and B is like a multiple target where it just slices them, slices them all. That's pretty good. Instant death, pretty cool. Yeah. Oh, the blood on the face too. No. Too nice face paint. Alright, Mara come in now. Uh, I think we'll let her do the work. Yeah, you do it. Yeah. Oh. There indeed. Hmm. What now then? Oh. More of them. Even more. They just don't stop coming. It's constant gore. <laughs> oh my god. Getting scared, Brad. No. Alright. So. Just keep fighting them off, and you should come to a point in a minute. Where well, I think this is the equivalent to a, a boss which comes over the hill. Boss? It's a freaking tank. <laughs> and it's got a whole lot of health. What the fuck is that thing? <laughs> This is enough to give me triple nightmares, bro. <laughs> Alright, let's just go for the attack. Just, I think your best bet is just to all out rage, all you spam your combo attacks and... Spam. <laughs> does that sister, does she freeze it or something? So yeah, every so often she'll freeze it, so I just, like, just start laying in all your attacks possible, but... Be aware because he does fight back sometimes. Picks rocks up, throws them, that kind of stuff. God. Nice rocks. 
Well, I think he's nearly dead if you run. Is it dead? Uh, I think when it gets to the bottom half, it's uh, oh, it oh. a special Here we go. cinematic. Holy thing. shit. Oh my god. Oh my. <laughs> uh, if you can keep doing that on all them monsters, I'm definitely buying that game. Stress will leave <laughs> Super cool. Does that not match the story you heard, Seeker? What happens now is this like a cutscene? No? Yeah, this is a cutscene. There is many cutscenes. I hope they do actually cut them out at the other end a little bit. It's nice to know what's going on, but then sometimes it's just a bit. I'm not really understanding the story of this game. No, neither am I so far. Well, number one, it's just about. Like medieval times, like there's these creatures called Darkspawn, which are like basically just evil. And you're fighting them off and things like that. So I don't know what number two is going to be about. It's puts you in the middle of a story. I don't, I don't like it when games do that. They put you in the middle of a story. You don't know what's happening. Yeah, yeah. Maybe if you're like a Dragon Age one fanatic, you might actually know what's going on. But it was a while back since I played it. Dragon Age 2 fanatics, eh? <laughs> hmm. Hey guys, I'd also like to mention that Bulletstorm comes out Friday and we'll be getting it Thursday. Uh, should be doing some good achievements on that and then uh, maybe a let's play, depends, I'm not decided yet. Um, keep the subscribers coming, we've got like 152, which is good, we've gone up like I don't know, I've gone up like 50 About this week. 50 in like 3 or 4 days, which I think is a pretty good mile show. Yeah, we're not like 12 a day, this is not bad, I'd say. Unless Shane Dawson's watching and thinking, oh my god, that's terrible. <laughs> but, <laughs> you know, it's good for us, it's good for us. And just remember, if you subscribe from now on, you do get um, entered into our Gears 3 beta code giveaway. Oh, yeah. Like, all the subscribers are automatically entered into a Gears of War 3 free beta code giveaway. We'll just send you the code in a message if you have one. We will be drawing it from a hat, so it's everyone has a... An, an actual hat? I don't know. I just pick one out. <laughs> Ooh, gold armor. Gilded. That's a runescape joke, you won't get it. <laughs> So now we go, I think this is a little bit more cutscene, I think it's basically just explaining about how his family got out of their town quickly. Tell you what Brad, these dogs spawn, they don't just seem to stop. No they don't, this cutscene is a bit long, I want to get put in some dark spawn, is it? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Everything you're part of. Oh, alright we're burning them now, alright. A little cut scene of where he starts to save his family. Another good feature I like about this game is how you can uh, choose which like direction the speech was in a conversation. You get options. Oh yeah, but say if you picked a different option, would it like turn into a different situation? I have no idea, but I'd... Uh, it'd be good if it did. Yeah, yeah. But it'd take like three years for the game to be made. <laughs> I doubt it. So, uh, I don't think it's a good way to for this. Looks like a pretty awesome game. Yeah, I think you'll be getting this game, will you? Yeah, definitely. I like these sort of games. And we'll do some guides on this too. Definitely. So, it's like, stay subscribed and you should see some guides coming this way from this game. And we'll be happy to do them because it looks a good game. And uh, looking forward to bullet so I'll say it again. Yeah, I'm not. I don't know really. <laughs> the most. I'm probably looking forward to the Gear Three beta the most. Yeah, I think that's like Gears of War is like comes from all of Xbox 360's players' hearts. It's like it's the home of the 360. <laughs> definitely. All right, guys. This video has got to come to an end because it's getting a bit long. And uh, if this video gets about 40 likes, we'll do another part. So, thanks for watching, guys. See you later. See you.